On November 23rd and 24th, the Pump House Center for the Arts will host their annual holiday gallery featuring items crafted by numerous regional artists including Robert Spear, Eugene Johnson, Norma McCombs, Sharon Ely, Joan Arnold, Robert Chapin, Stephen Kathy Maybrier, Patrick Sims, Judith Brown, Alan Davis, James Comer, and Bev Riley, and many others. Pump House President Ted Fickison says the gallery offers locals unique gift items for everyone on their Christmas shopping list. What we're having this weekend is what uh, most people might think of as a bazaar, but this is a little different. Ours is the Holiday Gallery. We have various items and artwork from all you know, different people here in the community and even some from Lancaster. Yeah, we're featuring baskets from Zimbabwe and these are all handmade by the ladies in the village and the money that we get from that we get from selling the baskets goes to pay the school fees for the orphans. There's a lot of AIDS in that community and a lot of their parents have been lost to that. So these are one of a kind, beautiful handmade, and they're only at the pump house. Nobody else in Chillicothe is carrying these. So it's a really nice gift and um, the money goes to a really good cause. Here at the Pump House, we try to support our local artists and artisans. We have a great variety of anything that you might want. Some very unusual items, some very unique that you cannot find anywhere else. And the, uh, our holiday open house begins with an opening on uh, the 23rd and 24th. And for the little kids, Santa's going to be here on the 24th, that's Sunday, from 1 to 4. Uh, for most of you know, uh, the Pump House Art Gallery is run completely on volunteers. No one here is paid. And to keep the building open, uh, we go through rentals, we have uh, donations, and also 30% uh, commission from the artwork we sell. This is what keeps your pump house going. So uh, please come in and buy something. <laughs>